counting down the hours until Monday's solar eclipse. But a new survey finds many Americans are not aware of the potential dangers of viewing the eclipse if they don't prepare. No, it's two bucks really break the bank, right? Yep. Bradley ba Blackburn spoke with a doctor about the impacts of this event, especially if you are traveling to get a better view. The excitement and anticipation are growing as the total solar eclipse approaches, but that rare view in the sky could damage your eyes if you don't take precautions. A new survey of more than 1,000 Americans finds one-third don't know looking at a solar eclipse without proper eye protection can cause permanent damage. The retina is really what gives us our vision, and that's the thing that we're most concerned about, the sun's rays impacting the retina. After the 2017 eclipse, there were people that suffered vision loss. Dr. Nicholas Kaman is an emergency medicine physician with Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center. He says while having the compliant ISO 12312-2 glasses is critical, there are other concerns to consider. Many people will be traveling to get a better view, which could cause crowding and heavy traffic in some areas. So Dr. Command says be prepared. The last thing that I, I think a lot of people are missing is the infrastructure stresses that the eclipse is going to have on our country. I think probably not enough thought is being given to what I need when I travel. You're going to need to make sure that your car has a full tank of gas, that you have water, that you have snacks, that you have your medication. He advises having an emergency kit with first aid supplies, medications, cell phone chargers, weather appropriate clothing, and a map. Be sure to discuss your eclipse viewing plans with family and anticipate that it will take you a few hours to leave your eclipse viewing location. All right, yes, fingers crossed that we get at least that partial view yeah, on Monday. Something. Clouds be gone. All right.